everyone, today we're going to play Crash Bandicoot, the huge adventure for the Game Boy Advance. Whenever I was a child, I remember playing the second, which is the Entrance, but I don't recall the huge adventure. So let's begin. A mysterious space station orbiting high above the Earth. That's that. Do I have to press A? Okay. Cortez, remind me why I keep you around. You have failed me too, one too many times. Uka, Uka, forgive me. I've been wasting all these years trying to vanquish that brainless bandicoot. This, this is Crash 3 on the background, by the way. He is of no importance to us. He want, we want to take over the world. Now, I've heard it all before, little scientists. What is so different this time? Trust me, Luca. I have a little plan to bring Earth's spewing inhabitants down to size. And now we're in the beginning. At last, my planetary minimizer is complete. Earthlings will bound to my superior intellect. Mwa ha 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 ha. Oh boy. Finally, after all these years of abuse, the tile, the tables have turned. Who's the little guy now? I, Neo Cortez, am your ruler. You will look up to me. Ha ha ha. I have finally won. Now, nothing can stop me, not even that little bandicoot. Crash, Coco. The world needs your help. Cortez has shrunk our planet to the size of a grapefruit. We must stop him. It looks as if Cortez is using the crystals to power his shrinking machine. Crash, if you find a proper crystal from around the world, I think I can build a device to reverse the effects. Good luck, Crash. We must find the crystals so we must put so we can put an end to Cortex's evil scheme. As I've said, I've never played this game. I played the second game. But this is all new to me. Alright. I just want to do this gives you um, any power up or anything. And ever this game came out, it was six it, it was six years after the first game. So and some of these enemies are in 16, is this a 16 bit system? Some of these enemies were from whatever, how many bits that a PS PlayStation has to how many bits this thing has. And I just messed up it. Is there any way to. Oh, yeah. There must be um, power ups in this game. Because I can't ground pound that wheel. Unless there's no power up. And we're basically playing Crash 1 and 2. Which I'll get to eventually. But let's go with the Game Boy Advance games that I remember. The, the second one. Four. Alright. So I did mess up. So let's just die. Or just pretend that I didn't die for no reason. That works too. I just reset because I can't. So ignore everything I just did and let's reset. There's no loading, that's one thing I like. <laughs> no loading at all. It just sends you straight in. No loading screen. That's good. And that's all I can ask for right now. I'm not even speeding anything up because I can't. This is the game where you can speed up like a RPG. Oh no, I wish I could. This time I'm not gonna hit the box, instead I'm just gonna go through the bonus first, then worry about everything else. But there's the extra life right there too. And that counts as the extra box, and I swear if I can't get all the boxes in one go, this is all for nothing. Alright. Now 
let's go to the next point and hopefully I'll get used to these controls because it's been so long since I played any, any Crash game on the Game Boy Advance. I even played the games that work remotely. Yeah. Like the ones with um, Spyro and Crash has a um, crossover. I remember those, and it was a button masher. I used to have to ask my siblings to help me out with the um, If you actually play this game, you know, um, the little. Whenever you have to pick up the dumbbell and you have the button mash to get pick it up. That's what I struggle with. So this is a little bit of Crash 3 and a little bit of Crash 2. So far I haven't seen one Crash 1 in the video. It's amazing that they can put it in with however many bits is a PlayStation game. Because I don't remember. 2. 16, I know this is 16. If it ain't, I don't know what it is, 32. It's either 16 or 32, but I really think it's 16. Now let's see. At least they have decent controls. At least you can play your your favorite bandicoot on the go. Back into down too. I don't even know how I got to play the second game. So many Crash 3's and 2 references and, and enemies. The little war room is a um, Crash 3 reference. So far I haven't really, I haven't died if it wasn't me really killing myself basically. I don't, I didn't jinx myself for once. And I swear there better be a checkpoint close by. Alright. Is there a checkpoint or we're near the end of the stage? Whichever one comes first, wait, what? Okay. I wonder if you can die right there. Alright. Now all we need is four more bosses and we got them. The only way you can get these bosses is spinning and I'm trying to not die. As you can see. Just like that, we went through two stages. First stage is Temple of Hill. Now, many boxes, 74, so this probably is one of the stages I can't get all of them yet. Is there anything down here? I can't get a glimpse of what's down. It actually clicked off. I can't slide, so that's, that's proof that I can't get this. Well, that's proof that there's probably power ups in this game, so let's stay close to the TNT because um, if you play Crash 1, you know, or Crash 2, I think Crash 2 it doesn't do it. If you are too far from the TNT, it doesn't count. But I can't get off the um, boxes because of me not being able to slide. I don't know why I'm doing the bonus again. At least I can say one thing, there is no loading. How are you supposed to get that? You're supposed to hit one of them bosses and then get the life. Let's try it. But every time I try to hit one boss, it winds up me hitting two. I have wait. Wait. In in the bonus it counts as alive. The bonuses counts as alive? For real? You're joking. I can crawl, that's about it. Because how I got how do I have no lives? It shouldn't even count as alive. This is not crash one. 
So I have no lives even though I have gotten a lot of extra lives. Oh wait, it's the bonus of <laughs> it's me getting it's me getting confused. So how many lives do I have? Thirteen. So if zero counts as a line, that means fourteen. I just had a brain for him. Whatever. Alright. At least let me get one extra line. I wish I could slide, but I had to go down here the slow way. Alright. Jump over. I pressed the jump button and it didn't jump. I'm just gonna skip it. You have to do it this way. Alright. Keep on going. Checkpoint. And there's my first official death. And that's a crash 2 enemy. I don't know, I don't remember where the wizards are from. I'm trying to remember. I think it's crash 2. And I think I'm dying a lot. At least let me get one of my last bank. Alright. Jump. What's down here? Let's see. Here's me about to almost die. It's an insta death. So down there is an insta death. If you hit spikes. What is this, Mega Man? <laughs> Look, I still had him. Imagine it. Well, I wonder if you could die with invincibility right there. Let's try and see what's over here. Alright. There's a lot of walking. All that for Red Gem, okay. See some levels do these um, certain type of gems. That one needs a red gem, and I don't know what level gives a red gem, so ignore it for now. And then let's get this extra life that I can't get anymore. I wish I had double jump. Checkpoint. I bet you that checkpoint wasn't there before. You see, if you die so many times in a crash game. <laughs> Sometimes you let the checkpoints be a little bit closer. I don't know if they made it closer or these are actually where they weren't. But as you saw, you saw another checkpoint, so that's probably where it's supposed to be. Alright, if I die, that means I don't get to keep what I have on me right now, which is Aku Aku. Alright, next level is Frostbite Cannon, I think. Alright, 114 bosses. This is the first level with Nitro. Alright, this, this is gonna be me dealing with specifically controls. At least we're back to double digit lives. So far, so good. I jumped. I know I jumped. It just didn't detect it. I feel like I'm playing the, the Nintendo sometimes. Whenever you feel like you jumped, but you didn't. I jumped again, but okay. I'm dying because of my still because of my um button smashing and not going through it. Now let's actually try to jump over this instead of dying twice in a row. I jumped again and it didn't jump. I don't know why. Alright. 
All right, let's see if there's gonna be another issue right here. All right, final. Wait, what? Well, this is new. Okay. Oh, I have to speed up and I didn't even know it. I didn't get an extra life, but I can keep speeding up now. I got I got two extra here, so I can speed up. I don't care. <laughs> I'll use the invisibility frames. Is it over almost? Please tell me it's almost over. All these nitro boxes though. Alright. I think we're almost done. It was me just spamming the button. And it worked. Checkpoint. At least you finally made it past the first part. All right. So far, my jumping is on point now. Finally. And here's the bonus stage. The only problem is if I lose it, I lose that um, extra two hits that I could take. So far we have collected no lives. And still have it. If I had double jump I could reach those, no problem. There's no problem to get those. The smart thing to do is three, four, five. Alright. Last box and let's get out of here. Isn't there, isn't, isn't there a button platform that's over here or am I supposed to fall? Yeah, let's see. I did not see that. Let's see. We have 106. If there's 8, we're good. So, so there's one right there. I thought I missed one. I jumped late that time. I didn't jump at all that time. It's because of slippery controls. And there we go. One more level, and then we get to the boss and end the episode just in slide. Alright, it makes you question, do they have any of them electric eels? I need 134 boxes and 47 more in here, so that pretty much takes care of a third of them. If you're wondering what 47 times 3 is, um... Uh, 139. So it pretty much takes over a third of these. I gotta die. So five more bosses and then this will be exactly a third, but this takes a little bit more than a third. I messed up, die. Okay. Don't mess up again now. I don't even really have to press that, do I? Alright. Long jumps aside. Two, three, four, go to the left. Don't press that yet. Got it. Alright, so what's over here? A lot more boxes. This is a long bonus. At least I know I got a free life, and I don't know how to get that without sliding, so. Alright, good. 
Gotta wait. Alright, we got it. Those are those enemies are um, usually in the in the very <laughs> near end of the stage of crash two. I gotta die. I gotta figure out do I get all, can I get all the boxes in one go or do I have to you know so you telling me I can't get up there. Oh you gotta do one of them duck jumps. But I can't reach that. So it's like, okay. Let's see if I can actually you know, spin and get that other boss. What in the world just happened? <laughs> well, that was great. Let's try this again. I guess I can't get it. Let's just figure out if at the end you want, if I would have got all the boxes where I have <coughs> a gem. Like I said, never played this game. I don't know. If you've never seen this game, this is a learning experience for both of us. Or how many ever people are watching this at one time. Okay, I guess I get no other chances though. But if this was Crash 1, um, the bosses would have respawned. So you basically gotta go through the whole level without dying once. But um, <coughs> seeing how levels get eventually harder, that would have been a real problem if that still was a rule. Got it. I really hate jumping over the nitro. Cause I don't think his jump is that good. I better stay ducked down. Alright, I had enough time and I cannot get that. <coughs> Just gonna spin on all the bosses I don't care about. Keep on spinning and running. Now the question is, would I have gotten every box? We don't know yet, because it's not the end of the stage, like I wish it was. <coughs> don't care, it was worth it. And I just messed up. So that's two boxes I didn't get, so let's see, three. So if it's at 132, that means that I could have got every box. But if I don't get every box, I'll do it off screen. <coughs> so don't worry about that. Uh, how you supposed to? Route double jump or doing this? How are you supposed to do that? I hope the Nitro actually destroyed the boxes I couldn't reach. <coughs> if it didn't, then. That makes it four. Alright, last thing we have to do before the, before the uh, episode ends, and I don't know how to do this box. And just like that, now I do. I had no short spawn. <clears throat> now, if this is Crash 3, the first boss isn't Dingo, Dingo Dial, it's um, Tiny the Tiger. I was gonna die either way. <coughs> It's obvious which crash game I spent the most time on through. Alright. Whenever this came out, Crash 3 was four years old. They made a crash game each year 
from 96, 97 to 98. You would not ever see that nowadays. I'll see the game. It'll take them some time. And I mean some time. Come on now. Alright, one more go. Okay, that works. Don't think I gotta make him attack himself on an ass again. Or is it just gonna be sharks showing up? If so, then I can handle that. Unclutching me. I wish I could speed this up a little bit, but I ain't gonna speed it up too much. Why does this show up like one split second after he gets rid of the shield? <clears throat> like one second after the shield tries to go away, why show up one more time? That's what got me. gonna keep doing this just to keep myself from actually going too fast all right if I wouldn't have died so many times and me not actually causing myself to die on purpose this video would have probably been less than 30 minutes Right now it is below 30 minutes, but uh, seeing as this boss is taking his time, it's going to be at least almost 30 minutes. I'll say 29 minimum and above 30 minutes tops. Now this boss is going to tell me if there is a um, power up or anything. So this shark actually does show up on his own. It's easy enough to dodge his attacks. It's just that shield got me. Wait, there we go. There's the ground pound that I was trying to do a body slam. Push start to continue. Ellie Marsupial, you got lucky this time. My henchman won't be so easy on you in the future. Alright, next time we will do Snow Crash and the rest of the level. So that is the end of the episode. I hope you enjoyed. Hope you have a wonderful day. Goodbye.